Don't talk about it. Don't think about it. Nobody breathe! Stop breathing! Is this a scary game? Stop breathing. I, s I know you're breathing. I can hear it. I can hear you breathing. That's creepy. I know. Shh. Don't <laughs> okay, you can breathe. A little bit. Just a little though. Just like... <laughs> Just a little. Just a little. Oh no, I'm nervous! Shh! Stop it! You stop it. Stop. <sighs> Don't talk about it. Stop! Dragon, stop thinking about it. I know you're thinking about it. I know you're thinking about it. Stop it right now. <gasps> Bro! Bro, bro! Bro, man, you gotta stop it! You gotta stop it right now, bro! <laughs> oh no! I didn't mean to push that! Stop it! Shh! Stop! TMI, thank you for the sprinkles! <laughs> thank you for the sprinkles! TMI! I gotta see it! Let's see it! I'm thinking about cookies and apples. I'm eating an apple. Good. Keep thinking about that apple. Everyone think about Dorgan's apple. <laughs> oh no, I'm too nervous. Look at my heart rate. It's 100. I'm basically dying right now. Just standing here. Apple cookies. I saw it, but haven't read it yet. No, TMI. Oh, Discord. No, you don't need to do that. Just remove your uh, your gift boxes. Just, just remove your gift, gift sub box. <laughs> Everyone, think about the work and sample. Just think about it. Alright, so here's what's gonna happen. We're quitting Cox! And we're going to AT&T! Stop it with the dirty minds. <laughs> I just gotta figure out when I can set it up. Thanks all. <laughs> Let's get down to business and play a scary game. Da, 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 da. Oh, by the way, you guys, if you, if any of you have a, a Mixer account, Cece's gonna start streaming on Mixer. <gasps> <laughs> no, it just says TMI, TMI music. It looks stupid, doesn't it? Well, I just know that everything I say will be held against me by the What do you court think? Hey, bad gamer! Everyone think about Zork and Sample. <laughs> Hi, bad gamer! Are you ready for scary games? Are you ready for scary games? Look at why is my heart rate so high? Man, I'm <laughs> I'm a chunky chunk with a fat heart rate. Fast heart rate? Not a fat one. See, yeah, okay, you guys, if anyone's on Mixer. No! Bad gamer! We weren't talking about 
it. We were thinking about Dwergen's apple. Not about the internet. God. I was I was on the phone with them three times today. This morning, and then maybe thirty minutes ago, and then fifteen minutes ago. <laughs> yes, we were thinking about them apples. Them apples. TMI, what do you think? Is it stupid? What do you think? <sighs> kind of reminds me of TMZ. <laughs> apples. What did you fix? Oh my gosh. Are we ready for this? I don't think we're ready for this. I don't think you're ready for this, Jedi. I don't think you're ready for this. My body's too bootylicious for you, babe. Hmm. What did you fix? Bad Gamer, how are you doing? How are you doing? What are we doing? We're playing. <laughs> so zombie! Like, what the heck was that noise? What just happened? So zombie! Welcome! How are you? What are you up to? Were you playing were you playing this? Moons of Madness. We haven't even started yet. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. ADHD. <laughs> you were. Oh my gosh. No spoilers! Don't even tell me how it was. Don't even tell me how scary it is. That'll just that'll just like me out more. My heart rate's already like. Is this guy scary? Already way too high. I was supposed to start earlier, but my internet's pooping out. So here we are. We're just now starting. Soul Zombie, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome. Uh, I'm really nervous. <sighs> I didn't watch it. You just saw everyone playing it. What? That's watching it. <laughs> Welcome back, Kalina. Welcome back. Bad Gamer, it came out today. It came out today. Moons of Madness. Soul Zombie, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the disco party. Welcome. Honey, I'm home. We're gonna get serious. Rokant! Rokant. Rokant. Dorgan, tell them what's happening without telling them what's happening. You know what I'm saying? Because we're not thinking about it, remember? Remember? Remember. <laughs> oh no, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I need a link. Oh my gosh, we need a link, you guys. Hold on one sec. We gotta make a link. We gotta make a link. It is. Yes, that one. Not over there, because I don't know where to point. Yeah, that is a heart rate monitor. Too many spooky noises. Ah! Yes, thanks guys. <sighs> I'm so nervous. Okay, so if you're new here. Oh, thanks! I made. <laughs> I made a clip here. I'm gonna go ahead and make a command for it. It's gonna be called. Uh, why no scare? <laughs> I don't know. Um, too. Too scare. E. Too scary. Sure. Exclamation point. We'll just do too scare. Closer. Oh my gosh. Dragon, thank you for the sprinkles. <laughs> Why is he break dancing in the cave? Oh, that's a different game. I came for, for the ads. Why are this urinal? You missed them. Lena, thank you so much. You're very sweet. Hello, Waterless. Thank you, Soul. Um, too scare. Um, how about just uh Diz Scare? Alright, there it is. Exclamation point Diz Scare, and that's gonna show you why we don't play scary games on the channel, okay? There it is. So, Soul Zombie, if you're interested, you can understand why we're gonna be about to be terrified. <laughs> yes, and if you are new here, there's a headphone warning, 100%, 120%. Uh, 
That's a good point, bad gamer. And we do, we do remember. <laughs> we haven't even started yet. <laughs> Don't get the humor the singles. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I've started. I'm so nervous. Okay, number one. Space. Okay. Number two. Sk like, sp squid. Space. I'm terrified. I have a love-hate relationship with squid. So the tentacles are what got me the most in, like, these trailers and stuff. The ter terrifyingness of it all. So, let's do it. I'm ready. Space tentacles. We call them spentacles. Yeah. Spentacles. They're waterless. I did it. I did it just for you. Dorking! Bad gamer! Get your tentacles away from me, you know what I'm saying? Spentacles. <laughs> that was good timing. Okay, let's just do it. Let's just get into it. No, it's too scary already! <laughs> okay. So, here's a little bit of background. At TwitchCon, there was a booth for Moons of Madness. And we went to it. And they sent us a code for it today. So, Cthulhu Daddy, let's do it. Let's do it. So, no spoilers, but oh my gosh. Please do make fun of me when I it do really bad. Scary. It is all going. What makes sense, bad gamer? All right, new game. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, you know what? You know what takes me back a sec? What a tick! You can't see it, but the bottom right corner of my screen says "Activate Windows." How's okay, guys? How's the sound? Can you hear it okay? Does it need to go up some? I feel like it probably needs to go up a little bit. I'll bring it up some. It's very quiet. Okay. So I brought it up some in OBS. I'll also go ahead and bring it up in here. I did turn it down a little bit er uh, more earlier. A little bit more earlier. Does that make sense? Okay. Can you hear him breathing? Hi, Sir Tofu. This is Moons of Madness. It came out today. It's a horror, terror, space, scary game. You can't hear him breathing. Okay. So I'm going to bring this up a little bit more. How about now? It is. He's just breathing a little bit. Chocolate chip muffins and hot tea. Does that keep you does that keep you safe? Do I need chocolate chip muffins and hot tea? You can hear breathing. Okay. All right. Get out of bed. I don't want to get out of bed. I want to die in bed. Please let me die in bed. And we're standing. We started off standing so that I can scream and walk away. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Wake up call. That's really cool. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. My nearly <laughs> My nearly <nailing> rare. <laughs> ah! TMI, we haven't even started yet. TMI. T ah! TMI! Thank you for the sprinkles. <laughs> Thank you for the sprinkles. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I don't know anything about this game, so I don't know if we, like, pick stuff up. I'm gonna do- okay, so this is gonna be really interesting for y'all. Because I'm gonna do my best to pay attention to the story. And I know we don't usually do that on my channel. <sighs> Waterless urinal. Down in my info section, there is a panel. It's called sound alerts. It's got, I think, three pages of sound alerts. The really scary ones you have to pay bits for. Um, but also follow alerts, sub alerts, donation alerts, bit alerts. They all are scary sounds. <sighs> I'm just warming up to the buttons. Uh, okay. Ah! <laughs> I just scared myself. Okay, maybe they're all going to be scary because of how loud they are now. Okay, so I can crouch. Fantastic. So Monday. 
May 9th, happy birthday to me. To do, turn off sprinklers, oxygenator diagnostics, and tune bio gauge. Space, you guys, this is gonna be so scary. Chess wins, me, Declan. So I know we're on the spaceship with Declan, or whatever it is, with Declan. That's good to know. Um, <clears throat> there's something over there. We've got home and Phobos. I'm really excited about this. I'm really gonna do my best to do the story, okay? So if I start to like tell the game to shut up, you tell me to shut up, you know what I'm saying? Team, I thank you for the host. All right, let's go through here. <laughs> There's a story? <laughs> I'm already not okay with this. Did you Hello? see him? Anyone there? No, TMI, I think it's three people and three people and over. Uh, because I was trying to uh, get more people to do <gasps> Target! <laughs> Thank you for the sprinkles. Thank you. My original plan, TMI, was to get more people to do, like, hosts and stuff, and I didn't want it to be going off every time. <laughs> thank you for the sprinkles. See, thank you for the host. What the happened here? I'm Shane, by the way. I'm gonna forget that immediately. What's my name? Immediately. Oh no, you're losing all your candy. <gasps> Misty Kit here! How are you? That's because they're always grounded. All right, solar panel cleanup. All right, satellite maintenance, airlock. This is really cool so far, 12 out of 12. Okay, I probably can't go this way because we just, oh, pick up a flashlight, pick up a flashlight, pick it up! Where is the flashlight? It's telling me to pick up a flashlight. I don't see one. So that must be our first quest. It's kind of like guiding me. It's really hard to see. Ew, why is it squishy? And why am I not concerned that it's squishy? <laughs> exactly. That's why I should be concerned it's squishy. Pick up a flashlight. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Probably the thing emitting light. <clears throat> awesome! <laughs> oh, my... Oops. Thank you for the raid, welcome! The flashlight looking thing. How was Vampire? What happened? I thought you just started. To toggle flashlight. <gasps> I can see clearly now my flashlight's on. What happened? Welcome, thank you for that raid. Let's see, what does it say? <laughs> Eight is really loud. <laughs> Eight is really loud. It's really loud. <laughs> and how did you pick such a good one, Waterless? Uh, oh my gosh, I know. Alp has the such cute emojis. Oh, they're so cute. Uh, Heavy boss battles and too much dialogue. Hi, Kiki! Is this scary? Akali? Yes, it is. It is. It's brand new. Came out today, Kinky. Today. <sighs> it is scary. You did find the sound buttons. Bring a drink. Okay. <sighs> okay, if you're new here, things will be going a little bit slow. Because I'm terrified. <laughs> All right, everything's very loud. <laughs> everything's very loud. I should have stayed in bed. Doing a thing for the sprinkles. All right, I gotta stop freaking out. Okay, my heart rate's 105, I'm gonna die. 
kinky. <laughs> we keep playing sound noises. It's just never going to make it to the opening screen. That's that's usually how it goes, though. I usually die before the tutorial begins. <laughs> Waterless? You're going to be banned if you keep playing the same one over and over again. <laughs> Power cord shoot. Ina is one of your specimens, Luz. Ina. Okay, so we have an Ina, we have that other guy, and we have Shane, which is me. I don't remember the other guy. Okay, I guess we're not worried about that. We tried going down that hallway. I think this is the only way we can go. Is there a way I can, like, pick that up or anything? No, it just says security protocols. I'm gonna- I'm about to change that one. <laughs> Thank you! Oh my gosh, that one's so loud. Whoever's meeting up late at night, I can hear you through the vent. It was me. By myself. <laughs> okay! Alright, you guys asked for it. You guys asked for it. <laughs> you bunch of suckers. You bunch of suckers. <laughs> I think the button is stuck. The sound coming coming with the bang one. The bang one is very loud. All right, everyone, hold on a second. Wait. Stop it! Stop! Oh my, my gosh! You really is the button really stuck? How that one didn't. So what happened? We're going to moons. Okay, and that was- the <laughs> That one's not stuck, but we're making this one 125. Because it's freaking loud! <laughs> That's the one that always gets me and I always don't change. Hey, Jaysaro! Alright. There. So, that's what you get for playing the same one over and over <laughs> Thank you guys. You kinky, yes. The, sh the gun is very loud. Lena, it was you, wasn't it? Tofu, I'm sorry. I'm working on it. Okay, I gotta figure out where to go. Someone wanted me to meet him somewhere with a drink. Someone wanted me to be quiet at nighttime with myself. Ina, okay, I don't have any options there. <clears throat> Why is the turkey gone? That makes me sad. I can put the turkey back if you'd like. You can put the turkey back. Okay, I guess this is our option. I thought we went down this way. I mean, the walls are, the lights are green. Maybe, maybe, oh! Why you can't start the game, scary? Pasa, Pasa, what in the heck? What is that? Game just started. Oh, what in the frick? Hello? Can I give you a kiss? <laughs> Poop and snoot. What is that? Honey, I'm home! That's the way you say it. Welcome back, TMI. Welcome back. Don't lick that. That's not a turkey bed gamer. That's a peacock. Oh, I'm glad that we're just okay with this. Ew, what is that? And we just... Oh, my God! Am I doing something wrong? Am I supposed to not be doing something? Or am I just learning? Demi! <laughs> Thank you for the sprinkle. Thank you for the sprinkles. <sighs> Thank you. <sighs> Bad gamer, I've seen them all. Long time ago though. Okay. Alright, something hurt me. I'm assuming it was the tentacles. That one's broken. Okay. <gasps> Alright, Fasan! It's no tentacle. It's a gentricle. What does that mean? How does this game immediately start scary? These people know how it's done. They're like, we're not gonna work our way into terror. We're gonna start there. Oh, Kinky, thank you. Ah! Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the disco party. All right, this has got a lock on it. Maybe I can open it? Open. 
What? What was on my hand? Uh, wait. Add to inventory. Yes, please. Yes, please. There's an episode maybe where tentacles invade Earth, and they realize it's not tentacles. They're reproductive tentacles. Oh, <laughs> I don't remember that one. Okay, first, that's that's the terror way. Let's see if we can go this way. I'm assuming all the red light doors we can't go through. At least not now. This just became half light. First of all, how do I get it out? Okay. I figured out how to turn the flashlight off and not how to turn it back on. Gentacles. Gentacles. So gentle. It's just a video game where we're in space with tentacles and it's quite scary. Science. I don't think I've ever played Half Life. Waterless? Let's go this way, towards the tentacles. Yes, that's exactly where we want to go. That's exactly where we want to go. <laughs> Guys, I don't... The tentacles didn't do anything to you, so nothing to be afraid of. The tentacles did hurt me five seconds ago. And look, they're destroying my habitat. That's something I should be afraid of. Half-Life? Half-Life is a scary game? <gasps> oh! Duh! I'm supposed to go back to the broken one. And, cro and Crowbar are open. I forgot about those new ones. Oh. Half-Life isn't a scary game. Lena's like me. Like playing Subnautica. And I'm like, this is my first scary game, you guys. And everyone's like, this isn't a scary game. <laughs> exactly, Lena! I know how it feels! Look, I've got the tattoo of the two circles on my arm. Oh, oh wait, I gotta tap. I gotta tap. Okay, so there was something right here in front of us and we're just ignoring it because for some reason. It's a bit Tim, I thank you for this <laughs> For some reason aliens that hug people's faces. It's 100% a scary game. No, thank you. It's not my birthday, but um, I hope you have a I hope you have a great night. Okay, good night, sweet dreams. See you later. Oh shoot, I can't go back through there. <sighs> Who? What? What? The woman said, "Come blow out the candles." <laughs> oh, sucker punch, TMI. Why is it immediately scary? I was told there was gonna be a story. And by told, I mean I assumed. Oh wait, it literally is a birthday cake. Suck <laughs> Oh my god. What was that? <laughs> Rise and shine, folks. Is everybody okay? I almost spilled my coffee. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'll have to check the readings, but that may have been our biggest quake yet. I was sleeping. Oh my god, I was sleeping. Standard procedure. New heart. You know what to do. If there's any critical damage to the base... I missed it doing again! Okay. You will assist me at the landing site for the Cyrano. Did I do well? you're on comms. Find any new issues and relay them to Shane. Aye, aye, Captain. Switch to a private emergency Oh, maybe we'll be... Oh, sorry. Over and out. Over and out, Josephine. Okay, fantastic. You know what I'm more worried about now is that we have to watch our whole crew die. Versus like everyone already being dead. But that was really cool. 10 out of 10. <laughs> okay. Good luck out there. Oh, I dropped my picture. <laughs> but in the crew in us. Yes, TMI, that's what I was talking about. Maybe we'll beat, uh, what you call it. Whoa, that kid is strong giving me a piggyback ride. <laughs> hey, Mary, how are you? Good luck out there, sport. Dad. Oh, I'm the kid. I'm the son. Okay, so move the view with the mouse. Yep, got it. To focus on the interaction points. So I can flip it. Tell us, poopy. So, zombie, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome to the disco party. Hopefully, we'll see you again soon. Have a great night. 
Those were those were words. I'm writing this down. Zero five zero nine. That's probably my password to the computer or my locker. Who printed my pin number? Rotate the item with A W S A D A S A. Okay, that's fantastic. Great, 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 great. <sighs> you are now redundant. No, I appreciate it, but that's gonna scroll up and we're gonna miss it. We're gonna miss it. All right, pick up my badge. Look at that's me, or maybe not. Move the view with the mouse to focus on the interaction points. Add to inventory, let's flip it real quick. So report misplaced access cards to security immediately. Reliable, responsible, revolutionary. The Arachi Group and our subsidiaries are not only world leaders, we are led by the world. Our promise to you is that our products and services will rise to the challenges of a changing landscape as we race into the future, together. <laughs> Hi there, gamer. Oh, this game is beautiful so far. Loving the light, loving the light. Okay. All right, dear dad. <laughs> Bye, Waterless! Have a great night! I have a confession I really want to tell you. Hey there. I've already rewritten this, re -written this letter six times. I'll probably rewrite it several more. I have a lot of time before I can actually send it to you. I'll put it in plain. I'm not in Antarctica. That expedition doesn't exist. Or if it does, I'm not on it. I went a little farther. I went to Mars. I hope you can forgive me. The deception is not a slight. The child went to Mars? The child of this handwriting went to Mars? I hope you can forgive me. The deception is not a slight. The company takes their security very seriously. In fact, you will already probably have seen me again in person before I'm allowed to send this to you. I want you to hear it from me. I want to know. I want you to know I love you. What I really want to tell you is what? You are the child of that handwriting. I wrote this. I wrote this as a child and I've grown up. These are my big fat thumb pants. That handwriting is your mommy. No, it says dear dad. <laughs> Exit. I don't, I don't know whose that is. So who is this? I feel like that's gotta be good luck out there, sport. Dad wrote it. He signed it to me, which would make me the kid. So I wrote this. What? I wrote it to my dad. I never sent it. Okay. Oh. Okay. Nope. <laughs> that doesn't work. Shoot. Sucky darns. Things. Things I got it off eBay. <laughs> that pick is you and your dad. I know, but I can't figure out how to do it. Oh, okay. I got it. I got an AWSD, but then click. <laughs> Dorgan. Dorgan, what is this? Say? Whoa. Shane Newhart, engineer. Memo. Declan. Security update. This is our security update. Please be aware of the new security update that's taking place tomorrow. You might be stuck in your room for a while if you do. Write down the code somewhere so you remember it. 0509. I want a shot! King, King. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Good morning, Mass Sport. Wilcox was kind enough to let you seep in a little today, but that also means that Dr. Van Buren is l tagging along on an EVA to the Serrano landing site. So I'll put a pin on the logging the issue with command until he's back. I know Lucas has been tinkering with some of the bio gauge code, so check with him first. Plus, you have a chance to catch up with the doctor. Make some small talk. Hey, Declan. So I wrote this. Can't find anything listed for troubleshooting the solar arrays coding. I've run diagnostics each time and nothing out of the ordinary. It's starting to become a daily thing. Time to file the issue with command, I think. Even if they can shoot me a workaround, it's better than constantly triggering auxiliary power. Um, tagging along. Okay. So my, I, what I'm taking away from this is these, these people are probably out of the, the spaceship this morning. 
or out of the not the spaceship because we're landed on a planet out of the whatever <laughs> well they're perhaps superstar i don't know what that is bad gamer i don't know what it is all right back down uh dear new heart there has been an update on your comprehensive nda please log in at your earliest convenience this is only a courtesy all changes have already gone into effect Come here. Head of HR. I'm coming, bad gamer. Here I am. The rule of two is an exciting concept. This is Invictus mission. A survey of a microbial life on Mars. The rule of two is an exciting concept. When we discover one example of a phenomenon in the cosmos, it is an anomaly. Given the vastness of the universe, it's if two examples are found, it implies there are many, mil many more millions, billions, trillions. As of now, we are only certain of life on Earth. An anomaly. That old naked lady. She was a dream. <laughs> but we all have to... But all we have to do is find a second. Any life will do. Even primitive alien microbes. Okay, so we're out here looking for life. On Mars. Got it. And we will. Because that's the point of the game. Okay. Confirming my ID bypassed security for my room. Doors unlocked now. Uh, yep. Glad you're talking to yourself. Just saying. <laughs> Just saying. Okay. All right. I guess it's time to leave the room. Oh, let me put my bed away. Cause I'm no messy fool. That's it. No, I don't want to leave the room though. <laughs> we leave the room and bad things happen. Oh, I didn't check in here. I've got a rock. Fantastic. I love my rock. Hmm. I am rock. Rock I am. <laughs> Thanks, TMI. <laughs> Talking to himself while sitting at his computer. <laughs> he must be a streamer. It's a nice orange rock. It's beautiful. Do you want me to kiss it? Put it back. What? Okay, put it back further, like a normal human would. We're no normal human. We're on Mars. What better way to start the day than assessing possible life-threatening damage from minor seismic activity? Mm. Yeah. I am alive, surprisingly. FTF! Thank you for the restart for Twitch Prime! You're the best. Thank you. How are you, FTF? How is life? How's life going? We're playing a scary game. Welcome, welcome. Let's get out of this room. Well, the rest of the team's out dusting the landing pad. And Dr. Bokova's apparently deep into her biocultivation duties. So, Burnt out. you have the base, all to yourself. And where are you? <laughs> Once more, I venture into the great unknown. Burnt out. Oh, no. Hope, hopefully good burnt out, FTF. communicating, which is technically Kind of. Got it. How are you deprived? It's time for the morning routine. The old morning constitutional. Yes, excuse me. Where's the toilet? Okay, so that one's locked. Someone else's room. Okay, so all of those circles are gone. Ooh, I wonder if I can see my hand. Maybe the circles on my hand are gone. So remember there were the two, two big circles here? How are you deprived? <clears throat> okay. So we still got all the red except for that one. Just gonna try him. I'm gonna try him out! FTF, I hope it's good burnt out. Thank you so much for the reset. Power cord chewed. Yep, got it. Ina's specimen is loose. That's our green that's our green way. This is our red way. Let me make sure there's nothing in here that we need. Do I still have the flashlight? I wonder. I do not have the flashlight. Yes! Yes, the ventigram circles. Okay, I do not, but here is a fantastic little spaceship. Oh, wait, dude, they're on my hand! Still. Interact. Ra -da 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 -da! FTF! Thank you for the gift sub to Bad Gamer. You're so sweet, thank you. Stop saying my name. Lena? When am I saying her name? 
Oh no, this reminds me of A Quiet Place. Have you guys seen A Quiet Place? That's one of my favorite movies of all time. Oh, Ina. <gasps> I just dumped all the guys out. It's one of my favorite movies of all time. Can I pick them up now? No, we're all just dead. I'm assuming since there's four of them, there's four of us on the spaceship. I love it. I saw it five times in theaters. <laughs> You just murdered the astronauts. I did. Oh, we get to read this this time. Fantastic. More reading. <coughs> I'll be right back. I gotta go get a paper towel. Oh, no. I got a, I got a napkin right here. Someone spilled my drink. Which one of you was it? Which one of you was it? <laughs> I like my message. Kinky. Thank you for using your channel points. <laughs> Foreshadowing. Yeah. No, they're gonna get me murdered. They're all gonna kill me! As you saw as you saw in the dream. It was me. Oh, it's hashtag Lena. Hashtag Blaine sees. Okay, security protocols. <laughs> Greetings, crewmate. As a member of the Invictus team and an employee of Manticore Orakai, there are security protocols that you must not fail to obey. Any Orakai facility, including this Mars base, is a sectioned by security clearance. Not every employee may go into every section. Your ID card contains a number denoting your level of security clearance. Your ID card is necessary to access all doors, sectors, and computers of a given level of security clearance. Urukai. Urukai. Really? Urukai? How do you know what the spaceship's called? <laughs> Do not attempt to access areas of equipment beyond your security clearance. Do not attempt to coerce teammates to give you access to their security. I can't convince them to give me access to their security clearance. <laughs> Do not give teammates of lower security clearance access to out of bounds areas or equipment. <laughs> Was not correcting you. Oh, I thought you were. Oh, Lord of the Rings. No wonder it sounded familiar. I felt like I had heard it before. Baloney? Why baloney? Thank you, Kinky. <laughs> Do immediately report any irregularities or breaks in security protocol to Invictus Tax Security at Orakai Tech Group .com. Given the nature of the work at Manticore and Orakai, these port protocols are in place to protect you from catastrophic mishaps and consequences. <laughs> they don't know me! They shouldn't have brought me along. If you are unsure of your clearance one of these protocols, contact your superior. Thank you for your vigilance. Lord of the Beads. <laughs> I'm totally not a nerd. No me for knowing what it was. Oh, t that's what we're here for. We're all nerds. What do you think we are, bad gamer? We're all just jocks and cheerleaders. Boom, ba, risk, shoo, shwa. Obviously me. <laughs> Thank you, Debrev. Thank you, TMI. All right, let's move on. <sighs> who wants to be a jock, yuck? Well, I mean, I'm the one who referenced it. Right. What the hell? Hey, what's up with the lights? Uh, yeah, getting some odd spikes in power as the batteries kick in. Of course. Yeah. Tight this guy's obviously not aware it's this horror game. Why is everyone treating me like this? I want to eat those. I was like, delicious. Let's do a workout. Lucas, clean equipment after use. <laughs> everyone. Also, the one who's watched all the movies twice in the past month! Oh, Twerkin, you got me with that. <laughs> there were parts I didn't remember. I haven't seen any of the Hobbit, the Hobbit ones, but I've seen the first, the Lord of the Rings, oh, so many times. But it's been a while since I've seen it. Lucas's butt sweat. It's everywhere. Pick it up. Gross. Anyone up for group meditative yoga? Let me know, Lucas. I'm gonna put my butt sweat all over you. I mean, all over the equipment. I mean, all over the equipment. You're not missing anything. With the Hobbit movies? There's the flashlight. Someone left it on again, though. It's like we're in a horror movie or something. <gasps> Nesting dolls! Why, ooh, the butt sweat, do you mind? Oh, that's backwards. 
they're not bad, just okay. I feel like I, I watched half of the first one and then fell asleep or something. Butler's notes, fisherman, investigator. Yeah, these sound like what I want to be reading on the Mars. Whispering in the mountains, steering wheel, dictator and joker, stairway up, galaxy, run, heritage. <laughs> it is kind of scary. Uh, is it not scary enough for you, for Dizzle? Is it not scary enough for you yet? Hi, Humba. Bun sweat. <laughs> the dragon was there for like 30 minutes. Oh, I thought the whole point was the dragon. Not as good as the Lord of the Rings. Okay. It's pretty safe. Hi, poor Dizzle. Hello. How are you, Humba? He's in the second one. Yeah, not enough of them. <clears throat> Who are these beautiful people? It has Orakai letterhead, so it's official. Replacement photo ID pictures for your approval. Commander Wilcox. Management. You clean it pretty nice. <sighs> but he's not. Rip Smog. He should have been there more. Rip Smog. Smog. Look at it. I would do so great on a space station or like on a whatever these are called. Because most of the time I'm like, I should really go for a walk. And I don't because I'm lazy. But if I were in space, it would be like, I should go for a walk. I can't because I'm in space. It would be great. Melanie, how are you? How are you? <laughs> I wanted Smug to decimate all those horrible dwarves. <gasps> all those horrible dwarves. <laughs> Got him. You're not horrible. I just, what your name uh, is. Can you check your bio gauge and see if your daily objectives have been updated? Copy that. Thanks, Declan. Thank you. I should probably get some headphones. <gasps> Melanie, there was one earlier, but there hasn't been since. So one out of 50 minutes, you're good to go. Shade. <laughs> no, that's what you told me it was from. Low on dark roast coffee. Lucas, your L's sure look like C's. The only candy allowed is Mars bars. But um, put up this sticky note about the witch. You like my drawing? I made it last night. Hmm. Do I like poking fun at a shared paranoid delusion while everyone is tired and isolated? Spooksy, welcome back. Okay, killer. Remind me not to talk to you before you've had your coffee. Um, I want to start coffee, and then we'll check our access journal. Insert. Why do I, I, I don't want to pick it up. I want to start coffee. Oh, there we go. Yes, coffee. Pretty sure by which they mean seeds. <laughs> Thanks a big mug. Welcome back. This is Moons of Madness. Spooksy. Brand new. Came out today. Horror game. So there will be scares in the future. It's perspective distortion. Which one is? Oh, the big mug. Uh, consume. Just chugging this hot coffee. And it's gone. Let's have another. Let's have another! Let's just drink it all. And then we can be the witch. Uh, okay, so tab. Crap. What's up? I, uh, I seem to have misplaced my bio key. The coffee is recycled from the station the sewage system. Gross, FDF! Love me some spoopy caves. I fixed the lounge door to the lab. The lounge door to the lab? Wouldn't that be a lab door, not a lounge door? Can I walk around with my coffee? No, I can only rock it around. Rocking around that coffee tree. Have. Now I'm gonna really have to poop. <laughs> okay, but even if it's regular size mug, you just chug that bad boy, two of them. We were really thirsty. We really want to be able to poop. On pain of death, do your dishes. Well, oh, there's things over what here. Uh, savory oatmeal or bacon and eggs. That Not poop butter. Choice. Coffee makes you poop. Coffee makes you really poop. Coffee makes you poop. Welcome to Poop Town. So that's my single. <laughs> It'll be coming out 2020. <laughs> 
All right, we're going with bacon. Bacon and eggs. Bacon and eggs it is. Have you tried the beast? Oh, uh, spooksy. Yes. Um, we tried the demo before the game came out, and I couldn't even finish the demo. Way too scary for me. Brown Town, the musical. Oh, I can eat both of them. I can eat both of them. Yes, delicious. And to think I was gifted the chance to hear that wonderful song. Yeah, Tofu, what would you have done if you never met us? Come on, you wouldn't even know that coffee makes you poop. Did it fall on the ground? What are those specks? I want to know what the black ones are. Those look like candies in the bag. Excuse me, may I have the candy? All right, let's go back and get our bio gauge, I suppose. All that is is make more coffee. We've already had two cups. I'm gonna poop. I'm gonna poop the world away shortly. Um, I I imagine I have to go back. Oh, I can't go back. I can't go back. Uh, you just started today, and it's so good so far. The beast inside. Uh, it was too scary for me. I don't know what it was. It like honestly, in my mind, it's not that scary of a game, but it was terrifying. I'm gonna poop the. <laughs> Thank you, Melanie, for the quote. <laughs> uh, and I have the two circles on them, bad gamer. The two two double circles. <laughs> okay, which way? Let's go that way. We're going left first. We got a bunch of messy teammates. Okay, Lena! Get some more tea. Oh, this is where we were. That's where the sucks. It sucked back down the. It's down the hall. This is where we fixed that. Look. Hi, secret region. How are you? How are you doing? Up top. Oh no, Spooksy's Spooksy's Spooks gotta update some kind of sub. Doing good. Half-Life 3 confirmed. Because we picked up the same crowbar again, Bad Gamer. You can't confirm it twice if I pick up the same crowbar. Okay, so obviously I need to fix that. Let's go this way first. Oh, okay. This is locked. First time was a dream. <gasps> Hi, Solaria. This is Moons of Madness. The new horror game that came out today. How are you? How's Green Hell going? Are you streaming today? No, you're Tuesday, Sunday, Friday? I can't remember. It kind of does look like some Nautica. Except for we're in space, we're on Mars. I'm going to go right, and then we can come back to that door. Can I run? Oh, I can run, and I can also crouch. We knew okay. that. Serious question time. When you get Earthside, are you... You, did stream, you are streaming today, okay. For a race. Use radio. You think if I ask, they'll give it to me? No. I got a timer for that, so I gotta pay attention to that. So when I'm screaming later and I need to use the radio, I gotta limit my screaming. <laughs> I follow you this way. <laughs> there you go! Oh, Kiki! Welcome! I follow you this way. That's funny. You have Tony Loons, too! This isn't that scary. TMI! It just began! Did you not see the beginning of this game? It was terrifying. All right, let's go fix that door. Well, I'm Thuddy McFudderson. Thuddy McFudderson. <laughs> Thank you too, Mike. What if the horror is inside all of us? By the end of the game, we all have a moment of realization. Uh, you're forgetting the last three times something malfunctioned in this over engineered campsite. Ghost smooth. Now, where is that bio cage? What if the horror inside of all of us, and by the end of the game, we all have the motor that makes you really makes you think. I don't want to be a tentacle, bad gamer. Take it back. Take it back right now. I forgot I picked up the flashlight. What if I didn't pick up the flashlight? What if I didn't? Welcome back, Possum! Hello, Flail! How are you tonight? <laughs> TMI. Um, 
my thank you for the sprinkle. How do I read it? I got a crouch, huh? Oh, I, maybe I can't pick it up. Oh, there we go. Thank you for the sprinkle, CMI. <laughs> the shot? Yes, it did. My day is good, Solaria. How is your day? I want to read it the other way. How do I close out of that? Okay, fade in. International Antarctic Outpost Z-17 day. Antarctic Outpost Engineering Area near a window overlooking an icy hillside. So what is this, like a play? The team is standing. Team, greetings from the South Pole. Wilcox. This is Commander Josie Wilcox. Josie Wilcox on the Antarctica Post Z-17. We're here testing solutions for plant growth in the harshest conditions on Earth. Exit. Ice flow. An icy beach area overlooking several ice flows where penguins splash amongst the waves. Delapore is kneeling down by the water, taking in the beautiful scenery. Delapore. As you can see, it's penguins' mating season, so we're sitting all kinds of visitors to the outpost. A penguin enters the ice flow from the right. Delapore. This penguin's this little guy is a chin strap penguin. While the chin strap penguin is still thriving, its natural habitat is threatened each year. Facility in the distance! Flail to the king! Thank you for that Twitch Prime sub! Thank you so much. Welcome to the disco party. You are already here, but now you're really here. You know what I'm saying? Now you're really here. Um, this is your first one too, isn't it? If you want an exclamation point, sub gift. Pick a, pick a color. Pick a color. You weren't supposed to read the script. It's a work in progress. <laughs> Team building exercises are key when you're stranded on Mars for years. So we just pre we just pretend. Yeah, pick a color. And we'll get to it. At an Orokai facility covered in fresh layer of snow operates in the background, sending up clouds of steam. Newhart stands, gesturing behind him, has the amazing engineering. Burr! But as you can see, Orokai's patented art, 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 Antarctic <laughs> superconductive coils burrow deep into the poles. Causing steady ice flows even during these hot summer months. <laughs> Thanks, too, Pride. It's literally the least I can do. Your streams are so. Aw, thank you, Flail! What color would you like? <laughs> you get a glow stick. Oh, you lost them all. Alright. Alright. How are you guys feeling about actually paying attention to the story? Is it super boring to y'all? Because I'm kind of enjoying it. I'm having fun. I don't, I get, there we go, now I'm standing. Um, so, I don't know, maybe we're making a news segment here. Um, we are looking for life on the planet. We are, we're aware of that. Um, sigh. Why are we sighing, bad gamer? Some other stuff in here. Oh, we've got robots. There are robots. Artificial intelligence up in here. Yes, of course you win, Dorgan. Of course you win. I'm not sure how to choose a color, so I can just say red here. Yeah, yeah, just say red. Uh, I mean, if you want to say red, you can say red. Uh, and then we'll get, do a glow stick and a balloon uh, animal here just in a second. Let me leave this dark room area and then we can do it. <clears throat> Thank you so much again. Okay, this is the door we came in. And then we went to the right. So it looks like I can't go in here. I, I, I'm assuming I need to turn the power back on. In this room. I don't even know what that all means. Um, it just means that I'm gonna, uh, we're going to make a glow stick for you. I'm going to write your name on it. Because I like to know everyone who's ever subbed to me. Um, and then I hang it up in the window. So on Fridays, um, sometimes you can, you can see them hanging in the window. Depending on if I'm standing or not. Um, and then also a balloon animal. <laughs> Sing a song about chickens. I like chickens, they go back, they go back, back, back. I like chickens, they go back, they go back, back, back. Chicken, 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 chickens go back. You're welcome. <laughs> Was that good enough for you? Was that good enough for you? Mouse taco. 
flip. Let's flip it first. What's over here? Reset. Just my luck. I need to I find need something, to find something that can that fit, can fit in, in here. here. Okay, let's add it to the inventory. Declan, I found the bio gauge, but it won't okay. turn on. I need oh. to reset it. Uh, here we go. Something small and thin. A pen should work. That's what she said. Buck, buck, buck. Buck, buck, buck. Yeah, there you go. Thank you, TMI. If anyone is interested in how tonight will probably go, there's a YouTube link to a montage I just made. <laughs> I can get to do anything now. Sing a song about Tara in pine cones. Taco. You get one a day. And you picked a duck. Or a chicken. I don't remember. Whatever you picked, you picked it. Look that how did it know that was me? Great. And a dance. It would be terrifying if you are. Thank you, TMI! Everyone enjoy your extra delicious thousand candies. Restart the security system. Scan to connect to your security servers. Okay, so we can toggle bio zoom with left alt. Shh. Navigate left and right with A and D. Okay, that's between our objectives and our inventory. Navigate up and down with the W and S. Uh, so we've got our badge, we've got our flashlight and our crowbar and the bio gauge we just picked up. If I go back to objectives, we've got these select and exit. Okay, fantastic. So I need to go back over to the objectives and restart the security system. Okay. The game has a BPM. Is that a beats per minute? You've been cut off from gambling. Did you just do it, uh, bad gamer? <clears throat> Did you just do a, a command? A gamble command? We do have a cool, yeah, we, there's a cool down. Okay, I can scan to connect over there. I'm gonna continue to look around. Uh, scan the environment. Oh, oh, we're scanning the whole environment. Oh, there's a rock. Whoa, would you look at that? There's a rock right there. Nothing scanned. You literally just scanned the entire room. What do you mean nothing scanned? Thrown around. What's thrown around? Fine, I'll take my candies to Vegas if you don't want my action. <laughs> Your action? <laughs> don't make it sound so creepy. Oh, there. It looks like I could pick that up. It's flashing. It's flashing like I can do something with it. But I guess I can't do anything with it? That book. <laughs> ah! <laughs> FTF, thank you for the sprinkles. <laughs> thank you for the sprinkles. <laughs> that reminds me of that orange box. Do you want me to go back to it? It's in my bedroom. We oh, look! Here you go! What the fudge? <laughs> Vegas, do you accept candies? What are you talking about? Candies. No, we don't accept candies. We're a real gambling institution here. It rocks. Good one. But um, 12 out of 12. Okay, so now we're in here. <gasps> Where did we get a frog on Mars? Did we take it with us? It's horrible, but I love it. Poor froggy. Okay, so let's go scan our thing. <clears throat> Martian frog. Scan. All right. Nancy Technologies Premier Security System and Software Connect. Error, the system is functioning. Reboot, yes. Scheme that she's these. <laughs> Maybe all frogs are from Mars. <gasps> Except for Mars is totally like orange. Go to the solar panel site. Oh, look, now I can read the things. It just won't let me like read them in the dark. The quake probably knocked the panels out of alignment. This has been an ongoing issue. I'll have to adjust the solar panels manually. Oh, that means I have to go outside. <coughs> Mineralogical analysis of Martian soil and rocks. This is by Declan, who's our is our doofus friend. Everyone knows Martians are green. They are? Even if they come from Mars? They are grayish green. Oh, boom, got them. Are you the weird... Weird not Nathan... F what? Wait! 
Implored manticores. I don't want to read this. This data provides information regarding the nature of the atmosphere, surface, and chemical. Can I turn the flashlight off? Okay, so the spectrometer to analyze Martian rock and soil samples to identify the relative abundance of iron-bearing minerals, including carbonates, phyllosilicates, clays, hydroxyoxides, phosphates, oxides, silicates, sulfides, sulfates, measurement of the ferric to ferrous ratio, determination of the properties of the magnetic phases, including the size distribution of the magnetic particles in nanophase versus larger particles in the Martian soil. <laughs> <laughs> this data provides information regarding the nature of the atmosphere, surface, chemical and physical weathering processing involving favoring phases. We shall find this relevant in studying the evolution of volatiles and climate over time on Mars because surface materials are major of volatile sinks. Yep, this is the stuff. <laughs> you know, we're not. What stuff? What stuff? In point of fact, the problems are associated with understanding the evolution of volatiles on Mars and understanding the processes of the past and our present that are responsible for oxidizing the round planet. Emily, hello! How are you? How are you doing? I feel like I haven't seen you forever. It's wildly unpopular science rap. The X3 spectrometer is the prototype of a manticore. Is that better? CNDA. Ooh, we got a non-disclosure agreement for all the Martians out there we talking to. <laughs> Hi, Nemi. Skit. Skit. Nemi Skit. Got your lappy back. Yep, on the laptop. Lapping it up. I'm glad you got it back. Thank you, Deprived. I appreciate it. <gasps> Pillsbury, how you doing? Hello, hello. Time out. Time out. I read that. I don't know, but I'm entertained. That's right. We owe you a balloon. We owe you a balloon in closet! All right! All right. Yes. Yes, flail to the king. Thank you, uh, Nimi. I'm so glad that you highlighted that message. That means so much to me. I'm going to save it for all eternity. Flail. Pillsbury, how are you? <sighs> to the king. All right, I'm letting this glow stick dry, and we're going to make a dog really quick. What you been up to, Pills? Nemi, you're getting close to being kicked out or muted. You better watch yourself. I was expecting a woohoo! A woohoo! Mm -hmm. All right. Thanks. I appreciate this. It gives me a break from the, the terror that is this game so far. I, did, I started at the wrong end. I started at the wrong end! Sekmo! How are you? I saw you playing this earlier. I didn't want to stop in because I didn't want to spoil anything. How is it? How are you loving it? Yes! I saw you streaming it. I didn't I didn't want to spoil it for myself. You finished it? It's that short? Guys, it's gonna take me 12 weeks. Rat! Thank you, Flail! Here's your little dog! <gasps> Flail to the king. Oh, you can't read it. The red on the red. And he goes back here. Oh, you can't see him. On Friday, you'll be able to see him. Thank you again so much for the sub. I really appreciate it. It does start really quick. Have you been reading everything? Oh, no. What have I done? I know. I was like, I can't believe. I can't believe they started this so scary so fast. <sighs> yeah, I know. Well, let's pop this and get back into the game. You're welcome for that ridiculous song. Flail to the king. All right. Whoa. Do I see it? It is scary. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. TMI. TMI. It'll be scary. I promise. Dorgan, I'm sorry. We're going. We're going in. We're going in. 
Uh, how about we don't do any more balloon animals? We'll make them up on Friday. Um, so we can just continue going. You're drawing creepy backgrounds for what? What is Invictus? And you know, the cup of coffee and to find the Mars toilet. Yeah, that's right. We were supposed to poop it out, man. <clears throat> no, I know, TMI. You said you'd need to go get food. So that's why I was saying it. My mom was in the Navy, too, and my best friend is going to helicopter school from the Air Force. Very cool. Very cool, Flail. I hope they enjoy it. All right, so what is Invictus? Orcry Group is proud to announce unprecedented defeat of science and human potential. Welcome to Invictus, Earth's first long-term space station on Mars. Okay, great. This is probably a pamphlet I do need to read. Um... The Invictus program will be ready to launch in the very near future, and we know you have questions. Why private space travel? We admire and are thankful to the pioneering work by organizations like NASA, but there are limitations to any government institution. Orakai, as a global corporate entity, has resources and expertise that knows no boundaries. We are uniquely situated to take space exploration to its next level. We are eager to show you. You better take precautions and find the Mars <laughs> And third mark. You better be sitting on that toilet when you check in that. Why explore the stars? Exploring the space. Exploring the space. Exploring the space. Not only furthers humankind's knowledge, it also inspires new technologies that make life for the rest of us on Earth that much better. What is Orakai Group? So there's Invictus and there's Orakai Group. How many hours did it take you, Sekmo? How long was it? Pretty sure none of our, one of our neighbors left their door open. No toilet. No problem, man. Eh? We have a crowbar. Orca is the world's largest multinational corporation composed of dynamic subsidiaries. Together, we form eight heads facing toward, facing forward to an innovative horizon. We see limitations as a challenge and the impossible as a dare. We will push boundaries. We will pursue excellence. We will change the world. Orca Group. We will. Oh, about six hours. Six, six hours. Got it. Because I was thinking tonight and tomorrow night. Um, and then if it continued on, we'd play it ne next week. Um, on Saturday, we're doing VR scary games. So you better be here. Give or take, depending on puzzles and chatting. Ooh. It's about seven hours. Okay. Okay. Leaders in computer hardware and software. So there's An Anansi Technologies. Leaders in hardware and software. Manticore. Okay. So this is just reading them. Okay, great. So let's close it. You have VR. That's right, Emily. You do have VR Skyrim. That's what you play. And I'm always like, how are you not nauseous and vomiting everywhere? Um, I don't... You have to ask Cease. He's streaming right now on Mixer. If anyone is interesting, interested in going over there and following him. Um, he's trying that out. Um, but he will be back. I don't know what his headset is, but he's letting me borrow his. VR than the ER. Good night, Jay Sorrel. Thank you for the lurk. Slice. VR scary games are too much for me. I know, Sekmo, that's why we're doing them, because I'm going to pee my pants. Oh, no. I There's no way I would do any of those in VR. What M word? Oh, Mixer. <laughs> Why? <laughs> you just 420. Wait. Oh, you're usually... Got it. Nauseous. Got it. Got it. I get it. Twitch doesn't like the M word. It rhymes with lick her? No, it d doesn't. No, it doesn't, bad gamer. Dorgan felt free to say it. Pants were meant to be peed. <laughs> it's not true. Lucas. <clears throat> Josie. They all have the same handwriting. They don't. They don't rhyme. But also... <laughs> I get it. Stop it. Stop saying it. Mission Control wants you to crunch some numbers on a potential future visit to the two... Okay, so we got two moons. Think over the logistics and of both... Um, and of both an Earth, Earth, Earth launch and Mars launch missions. Uh, work some rough calculations for both scenarios. Make this a priority. Also, have a look at the moon's orbits. Phobos should be 1.4 Martian diameters out and s with a 7.66 hour orbit. 7.66 hours? That's fast. 
Cover, they provide cover fire. And Deimos at 3.5 diameters in 30.35 hours. But Mission Control says they showed up a significant closer and faster. Might be a glitch. I'll leave it to you. All right. So our moons are getting closer. That's fun. We've already read this. <coughs> There's... Okay. So maybe those are our two moons? The two overlapping paths? Maybe is what we're looking at? All right. So what do we need to do? We need to go to the solar panel site. That's right. Um, which I assume is through that door, since that door opened up for us. Uh, I'm going to see if there's any... Oh, here's the thing that we, th we thought I'd be able to read. Help, I need to suppress the fire. I mean, cover pee. What? Log one. Supplemental log regarding our ongoing survey of samples and the search of evidence of microbial life on the planet Mars. The rule of two is an exciting conduct. What's the conduct? Is this supposed to be the word concept? When we discover one example of a phenomenon in the cosmos, it is an anomaly. Given the vastness of the universe, if two samples are found, it yeah, 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 we already read this. We already read that. What's an AFCS? Okay, I need a game with an NPC that says that line. First crotch or shooter. What are you guys talking about? Are you guys all on drugs? Look, we can look at the rock. Hmm. Why do they keep wanting me to look at rocks that are shaped the exact same? I think you guys are all lost your minds. Basically, goes of war, but everyone is peeing. <clears throat> so we were just in the research lab okay infirmary storage research lab living area and then the airlock so we're gonna need to go to the airlock obviously if we're going out to the solar panels let's check the other directions that's what I thought too Dwigan I thought that too I found a thing. Can I have it? No. And he is close to C on the keyboard. That's what I figured. Good night, possum. Thank you for the raid. Have a great night. Sleep well. Who knows what words are out there? <coughs> Why did you let me come in here? You just wanted to show off your ability to decorate games. Look, I can decorate. This is Joe. Joe is the intern and he's like, come on guys, let me make a room. Well, we already have all the real rooms covered. Just let me make it like a storage room or something. I can make a storage room. There, there, nothing even needs to happen in there. It can just be a little storage room. She is so judgmental. No, I don't know what you're talking about. <gasps> What's out here? That's where we came from. What happens in the storage room stays in the storage room. Good point. They're not going to tell us what happened in there. Okay, so we need to go that way. Let's check this way. I'm sure this is just going to loop back around as well. Yeah, it does. Okay. Oh no, we gotta go outside. <coughs> go in and outside, interact. I'm trying to interact with you. Equip. Putting on my helmet. What did I just lock it to? I don't have my suit on yet. Oh, I guess I just wear my suit around? We shouldn't judge others. We all have skeletons. That's a good point. We all bleed the same color blood. Unless you're in the 100. <laughs> nice orange helmet. You would. Oh, okay. Bottom right. So that's cool. They're showing us what our oxygen level is. That's great. Um, that's how I can go outside. We can unlock it. I don't really, I don't need to put a spacesuit on. I just put the helmet on. Interact. No, I didn't mean to... Oxygen is your face's lifeblood. Yeah, they're not scared, okay? He's used to living on the spaceship. 
All right, let's go. Indoor atmosphere. Please changing. Please wait changing. <coughs> it bleeds orange. You should go to the doctor for that. We're outside. I need to watch my oxygen. Checkpoint reached. Fantastic. Now we can die. <laughs> ah! Rah! FTF, thank you for the sprinkles. <laughs> thank you for the sprinkles. <laughs> Too much carrots in your diet. Pilot them. Can I, like, mark it? That works every single time. Wow, that got me! That's because we weren't expecting it! It's been a while since the noises. That was good, FTF. That was good. That was good. Shots fired. Mars isn't a safe. I'm assuming that's maybe our solar panels? Or maybe that's... Like in Zoom C? That's weird. How many points for a Damon... Damon poop potatoes? Are you talking about... Are you, are you talking about the Martian? Matt Damon? Do me a favor. Look up at the sky. I want to see if it's an if they animated moons in. Or is this one over here? FTM. There's that one and that one and then that one. There should be two Mars on Mars. You mean two moons on Mars? Yeah, right there. Right there. Felicity came. That's my favorite book. Of all time, it's the Martian. Fantastic, now we can die. <laughs> it's the truth. How's my oxygen? Maybe I should go back in real quick and refill. Yeah, my favorite favorite book. I thought they did really well with the movie. Um, they dumped it down just enough um, for the sciencey stuff to kind of make sense to people. But they didn't like, completely, you know, get rid of it. Which I think was amazing. I thought the movie was really good. I thought, okay, so I can't jump. That's what this is. It was probably like right outside the door to the left. The Martian, bad gamer. Oh. I bet running is probably not good for my oxygen. The movie or the book? The, is there a book? Interstellar book? Can I go in this one? I can only go in the one door. That seems unsafe. Look, there's trees and stuff in there. I can't wait to almost be murdered in there by a beast. TLC? Both came out around the same time for me. I wasn't a big fan of... Lucy! Are you done streaming? Did you get a spoiler? No, I didn't! I just assumed a big creepy dome with trees. Of course, there's going to be beasts in there. However, you just gave me a spoiler. <laughs> Where the heck? Matt Damon is in both. Oh, he is! I didn't know he was an interstellar. I thought it was just a oh, right, all oh, right, all oh, right guy. I'll see myself out. So you don't have to leave. Um, so if it helps, I know absolutely nothing about this game other than what was in um, the release trailer. Oh, I don't. I don't know that. Uh, do I know what I'm looking for? Probably not. Came back to see how far you had gotten. Oh. We're working on solar panels right now. Um, we just did a complete lap around the outside. Honestly, I kind of want to go in and refill on oxygen. And then we'll go do that. If they'll let me back in. Okay, great. We did a complete lap, as I, as I usually do in video games. I went the, I went the wrong way. Um, <laughs> the meowshin about a cat lost on Mars. I really hope you did make a book about that. All right, we're full, let's go. We're also full in poop. Not in poop, on poop. With poop? We're full of poop? Okay, let's go. 
let's get in this. It looks like we're gonna have to drive, maybe, to the solar panels? I'm looking for a three-part movie deal. Full of poop, thank you. Oh my gosh. Let's go back and refill our air! Our <laughs> great horn of poopy overflow it. All of the above. All of the above which, soul? Okay, we are gonna drive. We gotta drive somewhere. What's in here? Oh, I'm glad you let me open it, but not do anything. Um... All right, let's go. Let's drive. <gasps> I forgot we can scan! A cat's journey through space. It sounds very epic. I'm very excited. I can't wait. <laughs> the Martian Yeoman Reinforced Carriage. All-terrain is one of the Manticore's proudest innovations in off-world transportation and exploration. These stylish rovers come with advanced suspension systems, a reinforced triple alloy hull, and an energy-efficient state-of-the-art power grid built to safely get you from point A to point B around the red planet. Bleh. Why bleh? Deprived. Sometimes I feel like you just type so that you type. Most of your things don't actually mean anything. <laughs> First is about the cat surviving. Second movie is about a deadly game of cat and mouse. <gasps> is there a space mouse? Third is about life back on Earth. So you just spoiled it. We all know he makes it back home. I don't even need to. I don't even need to watch your movies anymore. Okay, engine hydraulics power. Um, oh, go to the solar panel site. So engine hydraulics power. How do I, how am I supposed to know where it is? Declan, nothing. I am buckled in and headed to the solar panel array. Well, now you've got nothing to do but listen to me. Oh, I don't Just get to drive. The migraine was starting to clear up. I didn't say I'm the cat makes it back. Oh. Today. Some fresh faces. Some so the cat doesn't make it back. Everyone's so on edge lately. Oh, I am driving. I don't know. Maybe I'm just imagining it. These I just wanted to make sure I was going the right way. Yeah, you're not the only one having strange dreams there, Ace. You too? The third movie is hinted. I mean, that it might be a dream. You log out oh, a TV spin-off. That's really good. Oh, no, I'm not driving. It just pre it just lets me pretend like I'm driving. Calibrate, more static, calibrate, then something sounds different. It's a pattern. You start decoding it. It's gibberish, but the static keeps talking. It wants you to hear the symbols. It wants you to hear the symbols. And uh, then I wake up and there's scribbled notes around me. Feels like I haven't slept in a while. All right, I showed you mine. Now lay it on me. Dreams, nightmares, nightmares fantasies, fantasies. deepest, darkest fears. Let's hear it. Sorry, I just pulled up to the office. <laughs> have to get back to you on all that. Restore power to the veins. The anticipation is killing me. I like that I pull up, like I'm driving a car. I pull up past it. 96. All right, let's refill. I can't move. I can't move my face. Oh, there we go. I can't move my face. Another checkpoint. TV spinoff will be called The Meowshin. Perfect plan. Wait, what were the movies called? I can't move my face when I'm with you. But I like it. But I like it. All right, door latch. Door. How do I open you? <laughs> Mr. Door, how do I open you? TMI. Thank you for the sprinkles. You were you. You were hoping I was smart and would know how to open the door, didn't you? <laughs> thank you for the sprinkles. Okay. okay. Locate the power that conduit. Not working. Someone must have borrowed a power cell. Declan. Heading up to the perilous rocky pathway. Power cell for the elevator. Thank you for the sprinkles. So, hey, How would you eat? How's your dinner? Landing site preparations are underway. Also, she told me to clean up my shit at the comms tower. I was hoping you were smarter. Yeah, I get that. I understand that. I like Josie. Josie and the Pussycats. Do I really need an elevator to right here? I mean, I guess. I'm on a planet. I'm on Mars. 
I guess it's, you know, the, the little walking that you can do, the better. But I like it. Okay, so we need to get a power cell as well. But we're, um, we are locating the power conduit. Looks like maybe I can go that way. Let's go the obvious way, though, first. Lasagna! Mmm, that sounds good. Oh, that sounds so good. <gasps> I want lasagna! Adjust solar panels to their optimal position. You can go your own way! Go your own way! Mail me a piece, it'll be really good. Rokon, are you still out there? Dwergin. You too. I sent you guys your mail, <laughs> finally. I'm so sorry, please don't hate me. I love you both. Uh, Lucigen, maybe I don't want to read this while I'm running out of oxygen? Okay, scan to connect. Uh, let's push a button here. Oh, let's not push a button here. Oh yeah, pushing the button. Push it? Hello? You're just gonna hold your finger on it? Oh, I'm doing this. What am I supposed to be setting it at? 100 maybe? Oh, maybe probably to something where it doesn't say low at the bottom. It will fit in a mailbox, yes. I don't know what to set it at. Oh my gosh, I can change the pitch too. Oh, does it want me to set it at 38.5? Am I a dingbat? Does it tell me? Did it tell me what I'm supposed to send it at? Hello, deprived. Once again. Hold it there, we get HBO now. Is there a, like a... Um, like a journal or anything. Optimal. Got it. Whoops. Boo! Go on, Melanie. Oh, those are cute. Fantastic. Uh oh. I messed it up. I messed it up! <laughs> Are you kidding? Now I can't find it again. They did say optimal for a dizzle and then I messed it up. I tried to exit. I don't know where it wants them. I'm running out of oxygen. Who are you, Dizzy? I'm me. What do you mean? Okay, you know what? You know what, bad gamer? Get your logic out of here. Boom. How do I exit? Exit is that button. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Optimize this shirt. Oh my gosh, do you watch The Good Place? You're about 70% sure that's a bot. Deprived? Who is taking power cells from my solar array? Declan, you know what? Who was out here last? Uh, probably Lucas on some errand for Volkova. Ah, they're always up to something weird. Creeps me out. I have never met a normal botanist. That's a, that might be a good point, Deprived. Is that what you're talking about? Hey, Joe. <laughs> How did the solar panels go? I'm pretty sure it is a bot. Hey, Deprived, where did you... What's your favorite color? Connect. Connect. Could not connect. Make sure the solar panel terminal has power. I mean, I don't have a thing. I need to go get a power cell. No. Deprived, what's your favorite color? OK. 
Okay, we need to find a power cell. Yes, what is your favorite color? Oh, sweet! Air right here. Thank you, FTF, for the sprinkles. What's your favorite holiday? I'm done going to sleep now. <laughs> FTF. <laughs> Thank you for the sprinkles. Have a great night. Sleep well, sweet chariot. Ba Badish? What's ba Black, silver, electric colors. <laughs> oh, my neck. Damn, I think you're with the sprinkles. <laughs> I think you're with the sprinkles. Oh, my gosh. <sighs> Hello? Is something coming up to me? I think I stopped it. Okay, here it comes. I'm just gonna go refill on oxygen, it's okay. I'm trying to move the good place, yes. It's bad ash. I love the good place. Uh, yep, push it again. No, 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 you ding along. Why can't I push it from in here? Deprived. I'm kind of glad to get out of the base. Walk around. Yeah, it's nice to step outside. Breathe in that non-existent Martian air. Well, there's that. But I can move out here. I'm so confused. Spread my Is it a bot? Like a beautiful dead Martian swan. Like a dead Martian Remove power eagle. cell. Thank Let's you. go over here first. And ding along. We love it. All right. <clears throat> Too responsive. Okay, I've never experienced that kind of that kind of uh, bot that just chats like that. I mean, not like that. Obviously. All right, should I take my helmet off? Let's go ahead and take it off. I probably shouldn't. The game wants me to take it off. Oh my god! Put it back on! <coughs> The game doesn't want me to take my helmet off. <laughs> well, why does it why does it look like hey, take your helmet off here. It's safe. Look, this is where everyone takes their helmet off and hangs it on the wall and doesn't suffocate. Why is that oddly? It was terrifying. <laughs> oh, uh, that's why I gotta change the. Duh! I didn't. I didn't pressurize the room. I'm so stupid. Who's that? What? Don't know. Oh, decreased. I saw I don't know. Decreased. Don't okay, got it. Let's just get this done. Come here. Bro. <sighs> Bad gamer. I can't feel. Better that. go find a power cell. Oh, should we take the one from outside? Why is this locked? Why are the lights off? Yeah, let's go take the one from outside. The thing that the everyone does it only applies when the other everyone's aren't lost. And oh, that's a good point. That's a good point. We are by ourselves, so I can't trust what I think everyone else is doing. Run! I can only imagine that they want me to take this power cell, right? Okay, let me so get inside. So what have we learned so far? So what have we learned so far? Okay. Alright. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> let me change this. Space moves. Alright. <laughs> I don't even 
know what to say. <laughs> this just in! Oh my gosh, Tommy! Tommy's giving me news from Mars! What is that? What? I can't... You... You can chug hot coffee on Mars? And you... You don't even need to poop afterwards? That's crazy, Tommy! That's crazy! What else is happening? Are you learning anything? You're not learning anything. The power just keeps going out. Like it's a horror game or something? That's crazy, Tommy! Why are you still there? What? Because they're paying you? They don't care if you survive or not? Whoa. Do you have plenty of air? You don't have oxygen, Tommy? You keep running out of oxygen and scary things are happening? Sounds like it's going well on Mars. Back to you, Joe. <laughs> I found the reactor in the mountain. What? What are you talking about? Is this news or Intellifi's phone call? Well, you know, on news, sometimes they're like, and what's happening? For urgent news? You know what I'm talking about. Uh, did I change it already? It is for an indoor atmosphere. Atmosphere, good one. Total recall. Oh, I haven't seen that. Is that the one where their eyeballs pop out? Or his face melts? <laughs> Thank you, bad gamer, for the news. <laughs> Man found drinking coffee on Mars. <laughs> this just in. All right. Well, so far, zero out of ten for scariness. Just kidding. It's obviously out. one out of ten. Geological survey report. Reviewer Declan Delapal. Just don't watch the new Total Recall. There's a new one. I've only ever seen the one with Arnold. After 133 souls, primary mission is finally a success. Located a possible water ice deposit 36.8 kilometers east of here. Serrano crew will be notified as soon as they're within range. Investigations are underway. That's right. Tommy, investigations are underway. It's like man found drinking coffee on Mars, but no in the way you think. Find more at 10. <laughs> Find out more at 10. At 11. Gosh. I can read. I can read. And also, I know times, so... I saw the computer. I know you're all like, but the computer! I just wanted to, to look around as well before I got to the computer. <clears throat> but the computer! Hey, Declan, why don't you give me your password? I'm just gonna check out your browsing history. Hard pass. Are these different ones? These are different ones. Log number 84. Flesh-eating bacteria found in the air. Will you survive? Find out at 10. <laughs> Welcome to the 8 o'clock news. What? We've got flesh-eating bacteria where you only survive one hour? Find out more at 10. <laughs> Solar panels are becoming a consistent issue. The power conduit logs the dip in power when the automatic sensors stop working and shuts down, triggering secondary batteries. Manual calibration seems to work fine and the panels turn and track the sun. Only remaining option is a coding issue and nothing I can find in the manual helps with troubleshooting. Honestly, the extra EVAs are great for clearing my mind to feel so cramped doing maintenance at the station. Looking out the window isn't the same as standing there in the sand, on the sand. Even if I'm just scanning and turning knobs, it's scanning and turning knobs on Mars. It's real. And with everyone being <laughs> about sleep issues, myself included, it's nice to feel like I'm getting away. Almost don't want to log the issue, but yeah, power might be important. There is a new total recall. Oh! Maybe I have seen it. 2012. Seven years ago. What was I doing seven years ago? Mars is real! Melanie, have you been to Mars? Tharsis MC9, Ulysses Collins, the current site, high priority. Drilling site approved. Thermal scan shows multiple possible ice vein deposits nearest approximately 34 meters below the surface. Quiet 10 meters, UV scans, nominal. Biblis Patera, moderate priority. Fossilized plant material sample discovered at quietude. <laughs> quietude? Three, testing required to determine Mars origin or particulates from meteor impact. Thermal scans most promising. Additional exploration approved. Though, distance, a major factor. 
Ulysses Patera, low priority. Initial samples negative. So we've got water. We've got plant. We've got clay. Does it have the lady? You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> no. With the three nubules? <laughs> Is it four? Is it three? Uh, I've been to Mars. The dust is great. It's really good. It's like, have you ever been to Sedona, Arizona? Uh, manual calibration required. Still no assessment. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. Yibbidi yap. Problems, issues. This is Lucas. Did Lucas think I wouldn't notice something missing from my outpost? <laughs> Lucas Van Buren, employee of the month. Seeing as the living quarters of this facility have become your makeshift storage area, I have placed a few of my own non-essential items in this space as well. I have therefore enacted a more secure protocol for the locking mechanism for the quarters in question. As you have access to this location on a habitual basis, I have allowed you to unlock privilege without password protection. I request that you please do not disturb my items as even though they are not essential, they are in effect my possessions and aid me in my endeavors. Thank you. Dr. Van Buren. Isn't a Van Buren in Seinfeld? Dr. Van Buren in Seinfeld. <laughs> Door unlocked. We're exploring the research facility. Uh, and we're also looking for something. Explore the research facility. Look for an additional power cell. That's right. Uh, um, I feel like we would need two power cells. But I guess we, we don't need... Oh, the Van Buren boys! Who, de who will not wear the ribbon? <laughs> who, won't, who won't wear the ribbon? Who won't wear the ribbon? <laughs> I think we never had the controls. <laughs> oh no, there's a salt shaker, guys! He's holding the salt and the pepper. Right? And he holds up the he holds up the signs. Who are the who's the gang who he holds up the salt and the pepper? And he accidentally holds up that gang sign. Melanie, ten out of ten. That was fantastic. Excellent, excellent. That's the one. Okay. Add to inventory. What is all of this? Flail to the king. This is a video game. Welcome. <laughs> What's all of what? We're talking about Seinfeld. Have you ever seen Seinfeld? <gasps> I need to poo! Let me poo and read my operating instructions. All right, we found that. Um, locate the power conduit. I, did, I thought I just did locate the power conduit. I should grab that cell powering. What's a sarn feel? <laughs> Wait, you should what? Oh, this one. That's a good call. Thank you for babysitting me in the video game. I would have forgotten it though. Thank you so much for babysitting me. It's on the other side of Mars. How do I get out of here? Stuff of nightmares. We found the space. <laughs> ah! That was exceptionally loud for some reason. TMI, thank you for the sprinkles. <laughs> Why does this keep happening? The loudness? Flail. Get up in on the sound alerts. <laughs> thank you for the sprinkles, TMI. Thank you. You're exceptionally loud. I know. I know. I know. There's no trees. So where does toilet paper come from? From the space station. Shane, what is the situation at the solar site? The panels are out of alignment again. Until the Cyrano gets here, I don't have the parts to test. We push buttons. Noises happen. We push button. Loud. Bang. All right. Oh. You know anything breaks around here, and I've got four Orochi execs on my ass. Orochi. If you want to explain to them why a multi-million-dollar piece of equipment is being manually adjusted every day, be my guest. That's wrong, Flail. You're wrong. <gasps> she said the bad word. Copy. Not your fault. With what? Back Deprived? Lands, no excuses. Get it done. Every two weeks, the space station just shoots down boxes of toilet paper. 
Sometimes they unroll and it's just like whoosh, 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 the long string of toilet paper. Oh, I'm fine. It was just loud. But that's what it's full of. This is, we're doing scare to week. <laughs> oh no, they toilet paper our base. Get out there, Johnson! <laughs> Get out there, Johnson! I need to poe! Dorgan, thank you for the sprinkle. <laughs> <laughs> it's so loud. <laughs> it's so loud. Look, look how easy this is. You just gotta know what you're doing. I feel really, I feel incredibly stupid for like not being able to figure this out before. All right, that's good enough. That do it. Hi, Shane. Uh, I made a bio gauge program so that you can see Think about the swingles, you guys. It, it circles cars three times a day. Um, um, it, it, it is required that every... Bam! Guys, I'm kind of feeling those push-ups in my, in my baby biceps. Adam, thank you for the visa. Five months. <gasps> what happened five months ago? We had a fun time, you and I. 